Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of your boy Ohms and my guys Briggsy. On today's one is another season prediction, this time Everton. Obviously, before he starts, because I'm starting to feel a bit deep now, but I'm deep in it still. <laughs> but I beg you boys and girls at home, like and subscribe, it means more to us than you think. You can, you can, oh, sure oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just wait for you to finish. So Everton, I mean, Carlo Ancelotti, great bring in from them, from the board last season. They've got a good team there already, like their squad. They've brought the best out of Calvert-Lewin. Yep, brought the best out of Calvert-Lewin. I mean, Richarlison, everyone's been hyping about him, how good he is. But, the rest of the team. It's crap. Yes. For I mean, like, they're the like they want. Their their defense. defense. Defense, mate. One, one, one. They got one good one. Maybe two. Luca Digne. Yeah, that's it for me. Seamus Coleman no. is no, reliable. Reliable, reliable, yeah. Reliable. <laughs> the fuck do you want that for? <laughs> well, you're gonna have to have reliability. I mean, yeah, you need reliability when you got this guy next to him. Oh, oh fuck keen, you. mate. He's awful. How he gets England call-ups, I'll never know. I'd rather play Harry Maguire, and he's in jail. <laughs> I'd rather play him. I'd rather play Harry Maguire from a jail cell yeah. than him. Yeah. I mean, like, look. I mean, Yeri Mina was at Barcelona. He's all right, but a bit injury prone. Mason Holgate is youth. Like, he's got potential. I give Mason Holgate potential. To he's like defense out. But yeah, they need a solid, a solid centre back in there. And I don't even know where to begin with Jason. Jason Jordan Pickford. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jason yeah, Pickford, you know. um, I feel bad for that guy. I know, man. He was so good. I've that World said, Cup was amazing. It's meant to be England curse, mate. I still fucking remember that fucking tip with his fingers against Colombia. What it's a save, England mate. Curse, mate. It's the England curse. <sighs> yeah. Just, yeah. He hasn't been the same since it. Even though he had a good World Cup, it just happens, man. Keepers is the hardest position, I think, to stay in form. I mean, how old is this geezer? 26. It's not bad. I mean, for a QP, he's got loads of time, Steph. But yeah, I mean, is a Joe Hart thing happening right now for him? <laughs> so well, soon I into think his I career. Bet, I, I, I've still got a little bit of faith in him, but he hasn't exactly. <laughs> Good enough to say that we could keep him at Everton. He doesn't need to be swapped out. Yeah, I don't think so. I'd give it at least another year, see what happens. Yeah. You know what? Yeah, I'll agree with that. I'll agree with that. Because he does have some. Yeah, he does have ability there, to be fair. He just makes stupid Oh yeah. <laughs> Midfield, I mean Andre Gomez, class. Yeah. Even when he came back from his fucking leg break, class. Tom Davies, was alright. Average, yeah. This Fabian, Fabian Delph was a good acquisition in terms of giving them a James Milner kind of player. But it's again where where do you want to be, Everton fans? Where do you want to be? Do you want to be having? Oh, he's alright. Yeah, but they're gonna be, say they got enough money to fight for these fucking places. Yeah. But I mean, like, Andrew Gale is good. I think Sigurdsson is a good, like, utility player. Yeah. But that, obviously, for me, talking about for this. me that's, that's it in there. But then, saying with what might be happening very soon, James Rodriguez into that as well. Perfect. You put James Rodriguez into there, Andre Gomez sitting behind, so you're probably looking at another midfielder, holding midfielder. I mean, Fabian Del can do a job for a bit. No. I mean, he can do a job. We can't win you games. And then obviously they've got. Didn't the attack? Out, they've got a few attackers. Didn't the attack? They were right in that department. I didn't even know Yannick Valencia was still there. <laughs> Yannick Valencia is still there. But yeah, Richarlison. Bernard with Top Wobie. Quality, Dominic Calvert Lewin, good player. Theo Walcott. Passed it, but he's a good bring on player. I'm surprised about Moyes Keane. I, I actually thought he would have done quite well. Yeah. But he's very young, man. This guy's very young. 20 years old. Like he's, you could just see he's got a bit naivety. Trust him, so. Yeah. But um, yeah, they, uh, they just need, they just need to. They've got a lot of money, man. Just go for it. Yeah, if they bring in a solid, solid centre back, and then okay, you don't really rate Seamus Coleman, so maybe a, a right back. Reliable. Really. He's reliable, he is. <laughs> and then I'm sitting on the fucking injury bench, mate. So we're talking three players: a centre back, a full back, and a holding midfielder. As long as James Rodriguez does come. Yeah. Then yeah, they've got something good. I think they'll get, get James Rodriguez. Yeah, I do as well. I do as well. And with Ancelotti, you've got a manager who's fucking won everything. Like, this manager has the ability he is to trophies, mate. 
Well, what's the way do you think you're going to finish? I've got them um, just missing out on Europa League, so I'm saying they're finishing ninth. I've got them eighth. Eighth? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, like, this is it. They're in that They're in that bracket of... But they've always been like this, though. They've always been like, oh, it's always so much optimism. But they get battered by the big teams. They honestly get... I think Tottenham but that's like, it, the defensive them, issues. Like, 4-0, like, at least the last three or four seasons. Just mm. whacked them. But if they re- rectify those defensive issues, then... They might have something there. If. I mean, yeah, it's a big if, to be fair. But they're reliable there. <laughs> You're gonna hold me to that, aren't you? Fuck! <laughs> I'm gonna stand by it. Seamus Coleman is He's the reliable. image of reliability. <laughs> Mr. Reliable, wearing a suit and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, yeah. Well, fair bit of fans. Yeah, ninth. I reckon just touching, missing out Europa League. Yeah, I'll go eighth. Strong eighth. Right. Well, you guys tell us what you think Everton are going to finish. Uh, it's another episode of Sanction Export. Please like, subscribe, guys. Cheers. Football is life.